Review happening today. Community members are marking Pride Month in San Francisco by installing a display of the iconic pink triangle. Let's head now to the Twin Peaks neighborhood where it is looking foggy and where we're going to find Crom Force Tiffany Justice. She's live for us as volunteers gather this morning. And Tiffany, lots of people already behind you. A lot of people, such an iconic event, and people are having fun as they install the iconic big triangle. Let me go ahead and step out of the shot for you. They are expecting about 450 volunteers out here to help set this up. This year will be the 28th year of putting this together. Founder Patrick Carney says they have 175 bright pink tarps and a border of 220 foot long sheets of sailcloth. And this installment is going to be about an acre long. Previous years, it was lit up in LED lights, and now they're going back to the canvas as it was for the first quarter century. Now, Carney, Patrick Carney, the founder, says he hopes this supersized installment will spark people's curiosity when they drive by. What is it, and how did it originate? 450 people here installing the giant pink triangle. And the reason we do this is it's a giant educational tool, so people become curious. And when they see it, when they're on the freeway, and go, what is that? And then they look it up. Because it's part of appreciating and celebrating any pride is knowing where you've been. And this pink triangle is it. So we try and commemorate those who wore the pink triangle in the Holocaust. The pink triangle was one of the many symbols they used. And this installment will be up for two full weeks from June 17th to July 1st. And the morning is only just getting started for these people. They have festivities later on. Reporting live, Tiffany Justice, back to you. All right. Thank you so much, Tiffany, for a live look at that exciting event. We appreciate it.